Welcome to Florida, one of the only places on earth where you're out fixing air conditioners on December 28th. Working at one of my rentals, I just got this old beat up two ton pain condenser. Compressor would not start on this one. This is the capacitor I took out. It's a 30 microfarad, it's a dual run, 30 for the compressor, five for the fan. This has a different fan capacitor, so we no longer need that. We just need the 30 part. But this one was no good because a lizard laid across the top of this and exploded and probably somehow shorted this out. There's this carcass laying back in there in the back. To verify the fault, I've got my million dollar HVAC tester set to MFD or microfarad. I'll throw my leads across Herm and Common and it settles at 25. Now capacitors can do what I call fall out, kind of work for a second and then completely stop. I'm gonna jam in a 35 microfarad capacitor and that'll probably zip a little more RPM into that compressor and make this air conditioner work better. I also don't have a 30, so I'm gonna do this. It's okay to do this, no matter what anybody tells you, as long as you don't go more than like five above. So if that's a 30, you can go 35. So let's pop this in. Here's the new one installed. You wanna make sure that your spade connectors are a tight fit on the terminals on the capacitor. And upon closer inspection, here's a perfect example of a burned wire right here. Here was the terminal that came off the top of the contactor. That's what happens when you have loose connections. So we're gonna fix that up and then put the breaker on. There was compressor. So I think we're good to go.